This video outlines how to configure the Raspbian operating system using raspbconfig. You should already be familiar with basic terminal commands. To get the most of your Raspberry Pi, you should configure according to your requirements. This is done by running the tool raspbconfig. You may have seen the screen before as it appears the first time you boot into Raspbian. To start with, we should expand the Linux partition to fill the entire SD card. For instance, this copy of Raspbian is installed on an 8GB card, but is currently only using 2GB of space. Raspbian is unable to use the other 6GB. To fix this, select Expand File System, and then hit OK to get back to the main screen. You'll need to reboot later for this to take effect. Next, you may want to change your password. Raspberry is easy to remember, but everyone that uses Raspbian knows the default password. You'll be prompted to enter the new password twice, and then hit enter to get back to the main screen. Next, you should set up your regional settings. First, select your time zone. I'm currently in Asia, and specifically in Shanghai. Let's go back to regional settings. If you don't use a UK keyboard, you should probably also change the keyboard layout. I'm going to skip this step as I use a laptop to control my Pi through SSH, so this setting is irrelevant to me. That about covers the basics. If you want to experiment with overclocking, then you can do so fairly easily. You'll first be warned about the dangers of overclocking, specifically that you might reduce the lifetime of your Raspberry Pi. It also creates more heat and uses more electricity. The next screen will give you a few options to pick from. For now, I'll do no overclocking. You may also want to do memory split. This changes how much of the memory is used by the GPU. For instance, if you're setting up your Pi as a web server, you should set the memory for the GPU to a minimum, which is 16. Once you are done, select Finish. The Raspberry Pi will need to reboot, and the new settings will then take effect. 